I'm Jay Basie, your town supervisor. We're here today at the Arlington Street Fair. Go around and see the wares and the food that all the local vendors have to offer today. We're going to go around and visit some of the vendors and talk to them and see what they have to offer. This is a great day to come out, see the community, see what we offer to eat. Come see all your friends and neighbors that you haven't seen in a while. Welcome to the Arlington Street Fair. Here we are today at the street fair, and one of our vendors is Get Dunked and Ken's Furry Circus. We have different odds and ends to offer up here. What are you selling today? I'm selling, we have three different kinds of cinnamon rolls. We have chocolate hazelnut, apple, apple walnut, and then a variety of cookies, as well as our homemade um, vanilla. And then we have our t-shirts and our mugs over here with all original artwork. That sounds awesome. This is one of the benefits of coming to a fair like this. You actually get to see things that are different and what people actually do at home with all their artwork is really great. Good luck today. Thank you very much. Here we are with the Spice Beast at the street fair. Give us an idea of what you sell and a little bit about your product. Um, we're an all-natural spice and herb company. Me and my father do this all ourselves. We have 16 blends. Four of them are sugar-free, four of them are salt-free, and we just are doing um, infused extra virgin olive oils as well. Thanks. How's business so far today? So far today is awesome. The, the market's popping. It's great weather. Um, we have some really awesome vendors here, so it's going to be great. That's good to hear. Good luck today. Thanks, guys. Here we're at the here we're at the Peach Hill Park booth, and Peach Hill is um, one of the parks in the town of Poughkeepsie, a very passive park. It's the highest location in the town. Um, we're here with Jim Challey. Jim, tell us a little bit about your park. Okay, um, this is um, a former apple orchard that we have. Um, laid out uh, several miles of trails, so it, it's a wonderful heat hiking place. Uh, during the uh, pandemic, a lot of people have discovered that this is a great place to go outside, get some fresh air, do a hike. Uh, the other thing we're, we're telling people about is an event on October 9th where we're gonna have some cider presses there. Uh, people can pick apples, make cider, we've got music, some games, uh, a maze, a grass maze for, for kids. Um, and then it's also the 15th anniversary of opening the park. Um, that doesn't seem like it's been that long, but it has. And so we're going to have some folks there. We'll do a little ceremony. Uh, Jay will be there, I think, and uh, a number, number of other people to uh, really celebrate um, one of the uh, great features that the town has to offer. Jim, I want to thank you and thank the friends of Peach Hill who have been a great organization from day one, Thanks. keeping the park upgraded. Thank Thanks. you. Thank you. Enjoy. Here we are at the Savona booth. Um, Savona is one of the newest restaurants in the Arlington Business District. They did very well during the pandemic. They changed their menus. They worked very hard to deal with the residents and keep things afloat. Tell us a little bit about what you're doing today and about your business. Uh, so today we have a little booth set up to try to feature some of our main menu items, uh, little sausage and peppers, kind of famous meatballs with the marinara sauce. Um, we've got uh, a new menu item that we're testing out, the rice balls. Uh, so, you know, just to kind of put our name out there with the community. Thanks, good luck today. Thank Enjoy the sun, what a beautiful day. Yes. Here we are, one of our vendors that has a lot of um, home artwork. A lot of it is done by um, a young student that's got Abby's Dance Fund going here to use some of the money for dance. Um, there's a lot of cute little odds and ends and paintings that she's done and then some stuff done by her parents here today. Is there anything you'd like to say about why your daughter's doing this? Um, she's doing this to raise her funds for a dance class because she said, you know, it's so expensive, Mom, that I'm going to start my own art business. And she's five, so she started her own art business just so she could dance as much as she can. That's great to have an entrepreneur at that age, and it's great that you guys are coaching her along to do this. <laughs> Here we are at the Muddy Nose Dog Biscuit booth where they have, I assume, are these all natural biscuits? Oh, sorry, Raj. <laughs> Since your booth is wide. Why don't you tell us a little bit about your product? Um, yes, they're Muddy Nose Dog Biscuits. They're an all natural dog treat. Um, they come in one flavor. They're like a wheat thin. They have a whole wheat flour base. A um, little chicken broth and some dry milk. Um, no salt, no preservatives. Are they homemade? 
Oh, absolutely. Homemade, home baked, home packaged. <laughs> That's what I like to hear. Small businesses making their chance to make their move out in the society today. And is this a full time business or a part time business for you? Oh, it's a part time business at the moment, yeah. Good luck. Hopefully, it turns into a full time business. Thank you. Welcome to Sook's Heavenly where you can love your skin naturally. I sell organic, all natural body butters, all skin loving ingredients, less than 10, and you can pronounce them all. <laughs> How's business today? Business is excellent. I'm almost sold out. Very, very good. That's very what good. you like to hear. Um, are you local? I am local. I'm here in Poughkeepsie, and I have a website at SooksHeavenly.com. You can order, and anyone in our neighborhood gets free shipping. You can't beat that. And I'm priced fabulously. You can afford it. It's affordable. And you get a good product, a quality product, for a reasonable price. I make them in small batches with love by hand. You can't beat that. That's what I'd like to see, uh, another um, small homegrown business growing, and yes. hopefully you'll become a big national business That's someday. Right. Walmart and Target, here I come. <laughs> I don't know about that, but uh, that's my favorite, but you're doing fine what you're yes. doing. Good luck, and thank maybe you. you should be a radio personality instead. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you, guys. Thanks for visiting. Here we are with this Cider Mill friends today, and they have an event coming up. Lisa, how would you like to tell us a little bit about your organization and what's going on? Sure, I'd love to. Thank you, Jay. And this is Ann. I'm the president of Cider Mill Friends. Ann is our treasurer. We have our... 10th, no, sorry, 9th annual cider tasting on October 16th from 11 a.m. till 4 p.m. And it's sweet and hard ciders. We even make our own sweet Kimmel and cider just for the event. We have a food truck, the dog house. Uh, we have apple fritters made fresh by Fishkill Historical Society. And who else? We Oh, we have the, the Roundabout Ramblers, the Sports Museum. It's like a whole um, community effort. So do join us, rain or shine, under the big tent. Definitely a day of fun. Yeah, and the Sports Museum is going to be highlighting the Brewers. Uh, it was softball. It was Brewers Softball League, and they were number three in the world for years. Outstanding softball team, and they were named the Brewers after... Juan Murphy's restaurant because it used to be the Bra House. So they took the name from there. So yeah, another Arlington tie-in. Stay in the shade. We're warmed up. Yeah, it's nice when the breeze comes. Here we are at the town of Poughkeepsie tent with Felicia Salvatore, our town clerk, and Joyce Longi, the assistant to the supervisor. Why don't you guys tell us what you're here to talk about today? Hi, everybody. It's a beautiful day. I'm just here welcoming residents, and if anybody has any questions. Otherwise, I'm hanging out with the supervisor secretary on this beautiful day, and there's some canine demonstrations going on in back, and if anybody has any questions, come on down. Say hello. And I'm the supervisor secretary, and I'm here today representing the town and uh, enjoying a beautiful day here in Arlington and helping people with any questions that they may have concerning our town. There you go, smiling away, that's what we like. Yeah. <laughs> 
Thank you everybody for coming out today and watching the video. I just want to remind everybody, this is an event that goes on yearly in the Raymond Avenue area of Arlington. I said it's a beautiful event. It's a beautiful day out here today. It's an event to look forward to in years to come. So welcome everybody to come back. Other years to see the event. Hope you enjoyed the video and the video gives you and inspires you to come visit.